I had an older brother when I was, um, uh, I was probably like 10 years old, and he, and he was an actor, and he auditioned for The Lion King on Broadway when it was first coming out. And so I just kind of followed in his footsteps. I think that's kind of when I knew. But you know, when I was like a little kid, there, I was always posing for pictures and stuff. So I knew I was kind of headed for, for performing. But yeah, so that, <laughs> uh, I just recently did 110 in the Shade with Audrey McDonald, she just, who just won her fifth Tony Award. And that was probably the most amazing experience. Um, I've done um, Aida. As mayor of Aida, I've done, um, let's see, All Shook Up is a, a new musical that was just recently. Let's see, I did it regionally. What was my other favorite one? I've done Hello Dolly. That was another favorite one. So. But, I, but I, I, I'm in a band, and I, I like more rock music, you know. <laughs> I'm just glad that there's, it's, Broadway's going in that direction. So done. Probably with 110 in the Shade with Audrey McDonald. Yeah, mm -hmm. she really inspired me to move to New York and kind of pursue acting on a larger scale and she really encouraged me to audition for American I or for American Idiot and mm -hmm. so that was probably the the best one a favorite part of being an American Idiot uh, probably just the the I don't know the marriage of rock music and theater you know, like both of the, both rock music and theater have been such a big part of my life that um, it's just so wonderful going to, you know, music rehearsal and being able to rock out, but at the same time tell a really great story. Mm -hmm. So just kind of that, that's my favorite part about this whole musical is that it's this music that resonates with my soul, you know, and, mm -hmm. and then the story also, that we get to act it. So probably be Simba um, in Lion King. Um, with Heather Headley, who's the original Nala. <laughs> that would be a dream, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> um, probably just to, to dream big and, and you know, oh, there, there's, I just think like, there's so many people out there that are gonna tell you no, and don't be one of those people. You know, like we're our own worst enemy. And I just think like, if there's so many people out there that are just gonna try to bring you down and tell you no, don't be one of those people that are telling you yourself no, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs>